What symptom is happening when DPF soot level is too high? Checkpoint. Check DDC code. DPF status. DPF regeneration function. When check engine light is flashing and the parked regeneration request light is off and you feel the engine output is insufficient or we said derated. Now, let's check the DDCs by using diagnostic tool. Open the engine hood and find the CIN 1 connector on the engine. Unplug the cover. Grab the diagnostic tool, Kubota DSDI. Plug the cables to CIN 1 and PC, then switch the key on. Choose Diagmaster from your PC. If it doesn't boot on, select Auto Judgment. Type your password to log in. Successfully entering Diagmaster, select Menu. Select Start Diagnosis. Confirm the DLC is connected properly. Confirm the engine information. Now, we are into the hump age of the diagnostic project. First, we need to check DDCs. If you see code says excessive PM3 or PM4, double-click the code. See the hour meter of PM3 and PM4 and compare with current value. If the PM3 and PM4 happen timing is very calls to current hour meter, you can judge the PM value is not extremely high. We can check the PM sedimentation value and then perform a parked regeneration. Let's check PM value and signals related to parked regeneration by Diagmaster. Go to Data Monitor and select Signal Group. Select DPF Manual Regeneration Request Function, then select Set Signal and Monitor Condition. Scroll down the selected signals. Check Parking Switch, Neutral Switch, DPF Auto Regeneration Inhibit Switch has existed. Go to All Signals, scroll down and find DPF Manual Regeneration for Switch and add to selected signals. Press Play to start monitoring. Check the neutral switch signal is on. When truck is in neutral, check parking brake switch signal is on. When it's applied, check manual regeneration force switch is on while press the switch. Then check the PM sedimentation quantity. CPM1 is lower than 50,000 or not. If no problem, press stop and leave monitoring. To start DPF manual regeneration request, go to utility function. Select DPF Manual Regeneration Request. Select Signal Group. Select DPF Manual Regeneration. Press play to start active test. Confirm that DPF Regeneration function will conduct it. After the monitoring started, press the thunder symbol to send the DPF Manual Regeneration Request. After send the trigger, parked regeneration lamp starts to flashing. At this time, press the regeneration switch to perform parked regeneration. When the parked regeneration is processing, the exhaust temp will raise to 1200 degree in Fahrenheit. So please make sure no flammable materials around the truck. After the regeneration process, the PM sedimentation quantity should drop to about 3000. If the PM quantity is recovered and no DDCs remaining, means the DPF regeneration is finished. If the PM quantity cannot drop to around 3000, please perform a parked regeneration again after 15 minutes. If you have any problem with the procedure, please contact us. Also, please stay tuned and follow us.